I'm way, way, way back in the Jack's Canyon Trail and the Manzanita trees are just getting bigger and bigger. This one is so beautiful. If I pan around to my right, and that's just amazing. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Still going further back into Jack's Canyon and just stop to look at the different layers of rock here. So cool. And I hear hummingbird. Well, that's looking back on the part of Jack's Canyon that I just hiked. Way, way, way back there. And I'm almost to the top of the rim, which is nice. This is part of the trail that I'm on. And there's the rim up there. Well, I made it to the top of the rim from the Jack's Canyon Trail. I don't even know what time it is. It's been a long time though. And uh, made it safe and sound so far. And this is a, a view of the Cowpie area. I don't normally get to see, short of being in the helicopter. That's Schnebley Hill Road down there. And that little pencil line of a road along the side of the rim there, it's not a road. Uh, the trail, that's what I'm aiming for. I gotta take that down and pick up the Munns Wagon Trail and hike it all the way down back and figure out how to get home from there. Still up on the rim, working my way around so I can start heading down. But there's the, uh, if you can see it, the Sedona Airport, way down yonder. So I'm overlooking town. It's Thunder Mountain off in the distance there. and Wilson Mountain. I came across these ruins years ago up here, mountain biking around. I don't really get up here a lot because short of a four-wheel drive vehicle, it's a heck of a hike up here. And I have not been able to find out exactly what they're from. I'm going to climb up there and take a little bit closer video. Well, 
It looks like part of an old chimney of some kind. Pretty tall. There's a little bit of a foundation you can't see from this side. But if I pan around, it's really smack dab in the middle of nowhere. I mean, who knows what was here at the time. Be nice to find out. I came back down a little lower so you can see what's left of whatever this wall was for. I'm getting lower down the rim towards Schnebley Hill Road, closer to the cow pie area, which is right over there. You can see Schnebley Hill Road winding around down there. And a little while ago, I was all the way to heck up there in that saddle. Came all the way across, all the way down the trail. And so I have at least five miles of trail to go. And seven miles after that to get back home. I can do it. Just had to stop and take in a little bit more of the scenery. Still hiking down the mountains wagon trail. Guess I've been into this hike about six hours now. Just seen my third person in six hours. Beautiful day, perfect temperature. Still have plenty of water, still have plenty of food. Good to go. I don't know how well it'll come out on the video, but that little line of a trail going across the side of the rim there, that's part of the trail I hiked down to get where I'm at now, down the Munns Wagon Trail.
Well, I'm gaining on the end of the hike. We've got a little ways to go yet. Still on the Munns Wagon Trail. Just stopped and decided to take a look behind me, see where I've come from. Went all along the top of the rim there. And there's that little thin trail that I dropped down off the rim on. And now I'm working my way.